Hey guys, Zeki here, and welcome back to another episode of Engineer's Life with me. Hi, I'm in a tree. Because <laughs> I decided to be. So, uh, what I forgot to mention last episode, as you can see, is I upgraded my armor a little bit. So, essentially everything is a base level of iron, which I don't remember, I don't think that's what it was before. I basically completely replaced my armor, just, but kept the, like, the, the, the experience and stuff I got, because I didn't just want to make a whole new set. So it's all like base iron, the armor plates are all steel, and the trim is all RD. So I think it's a pretty good one. Durability is pretty high. I mean, not I don't think it's the highest it could be, if I remember right, but it's pretty high. Durability is pretty high. I got a pretty good defense going, so I, I think I'm good. I think I'm good. And it looks nice. I mean, that's what matters, right? Is that it looks nice. <laughs> so yeah. Um... Went ahead and got some of this, the plates going, so I should have... Let's see, this one's almost done. 32 steel, 32 copper, and we're going to get more iron. So, yeah, I'm really excited to get into some more immersive engineering, because that's what we're going to be doing this episode. I never complained, claimed that quest. Uh, okay. So, I know I started a little bit of the forestry, but I was just like, when we get some quests done, just, I really want to focus on this. Because there's one, technically two things that I am really wanting to get. And they both involve mining. <laughs> um, one of those are wanting to be is I really want to start getting into the core sample drill as well as the excavator. Like, just all as in one item. And then the other thing I'm really excited about is getting into this mining drill. Now, I, if I'm remembering right, the mining drill mines in a 3x3. Three three, which, if that's true, is just excite, Just awesome. That's exactly what I want. The, what the core sample drill and the excavator does, which it's a thing that I've never messed with before, messed with before. Um, but if I understand right, the the core sample thing now it's not actually blocks in the world. If I, like I said, if I'm understanding this right, but the core sample drill will kind of search for minerals in a chunk that you put it in. So it's only a chunk. So it's only like the uh, this little square like right here. So if I put it here, it'll only search in this square. Um, so it's a really small area. But if I get a actual mineral thing, which there's different types of it, so like you can get things that are like prior towards iron, things that prior towards like lead and silver, like I think there's only two types that have 100% of certain things. But like you can get pretty much a mixture of stuff, but it can only find one mineral in each chunk if that chunk even has any minerals, because you can have chunks that don't have any minerals at all. But once you find it, then you put down this excavator within that chunk, and it'll just keep mining up. The, those mineral deposits for like ever. I think it's like 144 Minecraft days. It'll just keep doing it. Now the only downside to it is it uses a lot of power. And when I, when I say a lot, I mean I. Th the thing I read says it recommends a diesel generator because nothing else will be able to keep it up as fast. <laughs> so that one we can make in a bit, but it'll be a while till we can actually, like, power it. The actual core sample drill will not need that much power, it's just the excavator that does. But the mining drills, what I'm really excited about, because I do like to mine myself too, and these excavators, if we're really gonna have, like, different mineral deposits, we're gonna need a lot of them. Not just the one, a lot of them. So, we're gonna have, like, a factory of just diesel generators specifically to power these excavators, so... Oh, uh, it's gonna be awesome, though. This is why we need a lot of materials. Are you almost done? Come on. Alright, well, I'm just gonna grab what we have. And just leave with that. Because I don't think we'll need much else. But, I do think just to start out the the quest line a little bit better. I don't know where to put anything. We'll go in here. It's a honey pot. Can I, eat I can eat that, so that means you can go in here. Anyway. Uh, so I know we flushed out a little bit on the LV stuff, and then we also tried to make a little bit of the more advanced stuff. Now, we never made any more of the pre-feeders and stuff like that, which we can start, but since I haven't really set up the other windmill and the other water wheels, I don't think- my power supply is good, but not great, if that makes any sense. So it could supply a little bit, and it could probably hold these up okay. But I also don't want to be, like, draining my power constantly. So we're just going to let that sit. And I think the first thing I'm just going to make is go ahead and make these conveyor belts. If I can. Because we need rubber. 
And the only way to get rubber is we'll, we'll actually need to make this centrifuge. So we'll get to that. But we need sap, which means we need rubber wood. And rubber wood can be found in the wild, but somehow I have not come across it. But I do have another place that I can probably find it. Which is villages. Which, if any of you have been paying attention to my um, waypoints, I have a lot of them. And specifically the ones down here that are more far away, I have things called Zappy, Village 2, Village, Village 3, and Boat. I don't remember what Zappy is, to be honest, but it's there. But, I actually, what is it? Zappy is a guardian thing. Never mind, we'll do that later. <laughs> Let's go to village one. Now, I didn't actually explore each village, like, at all, so I'm not quite sure what's in each. But if you look on my map, I kind of, like, zigzagged everywhere. So Zappy's there, this is village, that's boat, and then I think village two and three. Whoop. Yeah, there's village three, and I'm not quite sure where village two, there's village two. So let's just kind of look around each a little bit, see if we can find those trees. I don't think there's a one in three. This one, just by looking at the map. Yeah. Well, we can kind of check out the villagers. I mean, we could probably take some of these villagers home. I mean, like, why not? What's over here? I haven't seen this one. <gasps> I'm just gonna steal from you. <laughs> you won't mind. Alright, there's cauldrons. Ooh, ooh. Empty jar. Empty brown jar. I mean, they're empty, but I'll take them. It means I don't have to make them. Okay, cool. Got a lot of charcoal and coal. Hello, let me in. Nobody's home, so that means I could take whatever I want, right? Ooh. Okay. I probably won't need to be taking everything, so I'm I'll come back later. I'll take that though. But I'll try to grab what oh I can't open that because of the stuff. It's a lot of arrows. You know, I'm gonna leave this. <laughs> like only that. Because I really don't need anything else that's in here. So remember, we're only here for wood. So those are fancy chairs. I like this house. It's got a very vanilla Minecraft-like style to it, which is always wonderful. That's a lot of potatoes. And books. Okay. Anything up there? Oh, there's more chests. I just want to see. I can't open all of these, though. Oh, these are empty. Ah! Ooh. Do 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 do. I like those. Okay. Alright, so we're not going to explore every single house, because that would take a while. But, like I said, we're just looking for... That's pretty. We're just looking for the, um... Rubber trees. Where's my axe? There we go. Oh, do these not hold them anymore? That makes me sad. I don't need that. We used to hold them. And I can smelt down those. Right, let's just put everything in here. I will raid anything that is immersive engineering, just as an FYI, because I want it, and it saves me less trouble of doing it myself. But yeah, I don't see- ooh, another house. They're right next to each other. Aha! I will steal. That nigga gives us free blueprints. Oh, that one was just empty. Okay. Hi! I didn't just steal from you. Come here. Oh, you're just an outfitter. Eh, you're fine. Okay, let's see. Like I said, I don't think there's any rubber wood here. I'm just checking around the corner real quick, because I could be just blind. But yeah, I don't see... And that goes up. I can't get up there. So let's go to village two. It's getting dark, which is never great. Don't freeze on me. Thank you. Okay. I This now is a forestry uh, forestry building in itself, which is always interesting. And I think this is a forestry villager. Hello! Yeah, it's apiary. So we can get mossy combs, frozen combs, and that's it so far. And this is an arborist. Ooh. I can steal stuff. I'm not going to do it right now, but I can steal stuff from these. <gasps> I can just... I'm a steal. Eh, I'm a steal. I'm being I'm being punished for stealing. I'm being punished for stealing. Stop it. Thank you. For stealing anyway. Aww. 
Okay, those are mine now. I don't want this though. Alright, was there a. I don't see one. Getting worried because there are only one village left when it comes to rubber wood. And this is taking too long to find rubber wood. In my personal opinion. I don't think there's any rubber wood here. Cause there would be a big grouping of trees and I don't see that on the map. So we're, we only have the third village left. I hope. And there is a good example here. If not, I think we'll be okay. That house is on fire and that's anything but good. No, it's okay. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, the sheep's on fire. Everything's on fire and this isn't good. Okay. Ow, ow, ow. How did this happen? What village? What villager did this? Ow, ow. I, I, this hurts. Just physically. A little bit mentally. But mostly physically. I think I got it out. I don't know what happened here, but it's out. And ow. <laughs> oh, I don't see any rubber trees here either. Oh, this is like a boat place. Hmm. Oh god, no, 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 no. You do not hurt the villagers. Jesus. Well, that sucks. There's no rubber trees. Hello. I'll steal from you again later. There's a lot of cute saplings. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll steal from the villagers later. But that's disappointing. I really thought there would be rubber trees in one of these places. Like I said, I didn't explore any of it before I got here, so... Hello. Just breaking in. Thank you. What's this one? And I haven't seen a lot of these buildings either, and I really like them. Like, I wish these were actual, like, normal village. Stop. Maybe not with a Steve head. Alright, now I'm scared. <laughs> I, I, don't kill me. I didn't do anything. Thank you. Okay. I'll just check out the tiny one. Hello! Oh, you, oh, you do have chests. There we go. Eh, nothing of interest. Bye-bye. Like I said, this is disappointing, so I really thought there'd be rubber trees somewhere. I have to see which, uh... Rubber sapling. I can get it from the extractor west, which I think is this one. But we'll need them well before this point. I guess I'll just have to go around and look for more of them. Poss hopefully, like, either in a forest or find a village that actually has them. But okay, let's go home. Home. There we go. Oh, we lost our dump chest because I filled it up with stuff. Can I open with that? I cannot. Uh, let's put it somewhere inconvenient. Just for right now. It's all up there. Okay. Oh, I forgot I had it in here. Get out. And shove what we can in here. What we can't in here. Okay. Can I not put a- I thought I just put all of you down. But I have more. You can't put a crate to crate. That, that's nice to know. Okay. Well, we'll go in here. Alright, so we can't get rubber, so scratch that. <laughs> I guess we'll just go immediately into making an enge engineer's workbench, because, I mean, we're, we're not going to get anywhere without that. Engineer workbench. Okay. So to make one of those, we just need three treated wood, one treated fence, and a crafting table. So we should have an extra treated fence. Somewhere. There we go. Three treated wood. One, two, three. And a crafting table. One, two, four. I grab five. That's fine. I can count. Workbench. Ooh. And an advancement. 
time to tinker. It is. Okay, so that opens up pretty much a good bit of everything. Okay, so that actually immediately opens up the core sample drill, which we can probably start. That's a lot of steel. I hate how much steel we're using. <laughs> but if this can get us more iron, then it's more than worth it, of course. But then there's also the mining drill. Now, unfortunately, the mining drill, for some reason, doesn't open as a quest until you get the refinery, which, to get the refinery, you need a fermenter and a squeezer. So... But honestly, I'm gonna make it anyway. <laughs> I don't know if there's much that we can do with it yet. I don't know if there's anywhere I can put this down either. But I'm gonna make it and see what happens. So, to make a mining drill, we just need one heavy engineering block, which we should have two. Yes. I don't know what task that completed. Oh, the metal press. <laughs> Oh, do we want to do that on a metal press? I want to mine. <laughs> Alright, so we need a steel plate, which is four steel plates and a piece of copper. So, one, two, three, four. I'm going to complete a lot of tasks for things that I don't actually have, so that's okay. And then we need two wooden grips, which to make each grip, I need a piece of copper and treated sticks. So that's not bad. So we'll just need one, two, three, four. Oh, I'm out. That's not good. Hang on. Let's go ahead and grab our extra table, and I have a use for it. Fuck it. And... Oh yeah, I don't have a waypoint to where it's at. Let's just eat. Sleep and then we'll fly down there. Because so we need to go to where all of our uh, creosote oil is being stored. Alright, let's go. Hello cows, hello creeper. Bye bye creeper. Do do do, we can actually fly faster than this. There we go. Right into the building. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna put that here. And I'm gonna do this. And we're gonna do... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Task completed for stuff I don't use. Now let's just hope I don't make a lot of chests again, because it seems like almost every time that I do this, I just make a ton of chests, because I'm not thinking. One. Come on. Two. Three. Okay, I didn't do it that time, so I'm proud of me. <laughs> Alright, we can put the buckets back. So we can do this while we're here, actually, because all I need is my saw. And then I need to do this. One, two, three, four, five should be enough. Yeah. Two wooden grips. Yay! And then we can make the mining drill. Power pick. Craft the mining drill. Yay! Okay, so now we need a... Yes. Yep. A drill head. Which we probably actually just want to go ahead for the steel one. Yeah, because the mining area says a 3x3x1, three by three by which is like what a Tinker Sandler would do. Or we could do the iron drill, which would do 2x2x1. Two by two by There's also a difference of mining speed and also a mining level. So I think we just, since we have the steel, why not? The durability is also way higher, so I don't imagine myself going through it that fast. I could end up doing it anyway, but we'll see. And we'll go ahead and put up the saw, and let's just grab a lot of steel. We're gonna need two blocks... And then steelhead. There we go. So, let's see. I'm trying to remember how to do it. I think we need to do it in the engineering table. Mining drill. Haha! -ha! We did it. There's my axe. <laughs> I can never craft things the way I want them to. There we go. Yay, we got our mining drill. So, now I. This needs power? Or no? We're about to find out. Cave. Yeah, it needs fuel. I was gonna say. So, drill head's fine, but now we need to add fuel to it. And that's the part where I'm not quite sure what, how to do that. What well, says fuel? I thought it was power. Unless power is fuel. Eh, what's that? 
What is that thing in particular? At immersive. Let's see if we can find something that looks exactly like that. Oh, that's I know what that. Yeah, those were the shade. I can make my drill look different. Do I have them? Do I have any? Probably don't. Because I usually throw them away. Because they're essentially useless. But now I finally have the opportunity to have one and I don't have any! Mm. Well, that's sad. Oh well, okay. Well, that's the shaders thing, so I'm not quite sure how to add the power to it, though. Or the fuel, as it says. I guess I'll figure that out in the next episode, because we're at the end of this one. So yay! I'm just hoping that by the time we actually like get to this quest, we'll just go ahead and claim. So I really don't want to make another mining drill. Though honestly, I think I could just remove the head on it, and the mining drill might count still. That's a good. That's a good. It's good thinking. Uh, so yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you have any tips, tricks, or anything like that, please put it down in the comments below. They're always appreciated. Uh, I think off camera, I will just try to learn things. <laughs> Get a lot more materials and just learn so that we can be better prepared for the upcoming episodes. So yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye!